A date tonight, a foster parent in Indianapolis now charged with neglect and battery after doctors discover his foster child had bruises and more than two dozen broken bones. This one's kind of hard to hear. 24 Hour News 8's V. Win live at the Marion County Jail with the latest on the arrest. V, good evening to you. Yeah, Phil and Brooks, so we checked the court records online just to see the status of 26 year old Kyle Rice, and it looks like he has already bonded out of jail. Now, the abuse came to light when his mother noticed a suspicious mark on the baby's leg and told his wife. Now, doctors at Riley Hospital knew something was wrong when they checked the two month old baby girl. They took x rays and saw she had 35 broken bones and other injuries to her hands, legs, feet, upper, and lower back. According to court documents, her foster parent, Kyle Rice, admitted. Admitted to causing those injuries. Child advocates with the villages of Indiana say that this case is alarming and does not represent all foster parents. According to court documents, Rice told investigators the baby was being fussy. He tried to give her a bottle, but she was spitting it out. He then changed her diaper and she pooped while he was changing it. He held her, but she continued to cry and wouldn't calm down. He admitted to investigators he squeezed her really hard, bent her legs, and squeezed her hands and feet. He told them he was frustrated. Frustrated. Being a parent is the most difficult job and the one for which we have the least training, I might add, of any job that we'll have, but that doesn't excuse um, maltreating a child and that's what happened here. Rice's wife told investigators she had no idea about the injuries. She says she works full time while her husband stays home with the kids. They have been foster parents for quite some time now and even adopted three children. According to court records, Rice is due back in court in April. Reporting live from downtown Indianapolis, V. Wynn, 24 Hour News 8.